This week's feast. Calhoun's coffee. So for this week's mini feast, we are making Dean Ernie Calhoun's favorite kind of coffee. Which is called Red Eye. It's a shot of espresso inside a regular cup of drip coffee. That's right, and Calhoun is a man of exquisite taste. So for that, we have gotten him an African blend of beans. Ooh, Delicious. Fancy. We will also be using ground espresso. So for this recipe, we're gonna be using three coffee appliances today. We are using a grinder, a French press, and a mocha pot. And the reason we have a mocha pot is for the espresso, and not everyone can afford an espresso machine, which is like 100 bucks, 200 bucks. So the mocha pot is essentially a way to make espresso that's not the real way, I suppose, for the coffee fanatics, but it's something that's very comparable. Hmm, and where do you get this thing? I got this at Macy's. You can buy me there! And it's cheap, it's affordable, and it's a really cool looking thing. I feel like I could take this camping. Take your exotic coffee beans and put them into your grinder. For the French press, we're going to need a coarser grind so that the particles don't get pushed through the mesh wiring. It should look something like this. Then bring a pot of water to the ideal coffee temperature between 195 and 205 degrees Fahrenheit. Add your ground coffee to the French press, then the hot water. Give it a stir to make sure that everything's mixed together and not stuck to the bottom, then add in the remaining water. Put the top of the French press on and move the plunger right to the top of the water line. So before we get to plop the plunger down, you need to set a timer for three minutes so that the water can absorb all the coffee grinds so we can get the strongest possible brew. And plunge! Slow and steady wins the race. We're pushing all that coffee to the bottom, only leaving the delicious coffee on top. Here's part number one. It's neat how these work. I know, French press, great way to make really great rad. coffee. To make your espresso, separate the mocha pot into both halves and remove the basket. Then just fill it up with your espresso grind to the top. Fill the bottom half of the mocha pot up to the fill line. Put the basket in on top and screw the top half back on. Then just place it over medium high heat and wait for the magic to start. This is what it'll look like when the coffee starts brewing. We don't actually recommend opening it as it can spill out and burn you, so be careful. Once your espresso is done, pour it into your uh, espresso cup slash teacup, and then just add it to your coffee. A little spillage might happen. For you. Thank you, dear. And so I pour this whole shot of espresso. That's right. It's called a red eye because it will keep you up. Let's clean this up right here. Good idea. Tidy kitchen. Voila, you have concocted Calhoun's coffee. Running a school can be tiring business, you know? Oh yeah, especially with GHS. That's right. That's coffee. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Wow. See you guys next week. <laughs> oh my goodness, that is roasty. What's a good coffee word? Roasty, toasty. Toasty? You hear people describe coffee as toasty? I do not ever hear anyone describe coffee as toasty. What are some good coffee words? It is a full, rich blend. Um, I think yeah. you have to use like big full, words. Full, rich blend. I've heard go. that, it's, I feel uh, like. It's, it's, what? it's got weight and character. No. no. Aroma. Aroma, maybe. Uh, it's got... What else? Uh, here we go. Peak, Peak flavor. flavor. Mm. Roaster. There we go. Mouth-watering, multi-sweetness with a medley Dark, dark berry notes. notes. Is it? Let's, let's mm. see if we can find the notes here. Yeah, that definitely. Mm. I think I can. Mm. I don't know about that. I don't know. I think I'm too much of a coffee neophyte to be able to taste the notes. That's a good coffee. Yeah. I taste a lot of notes. <laughs> I don't know what notes taste notes. like. He tastes a lot of notes, guys. <laughs> Tell us what you think about your coffee right. and the notes. In the notes it section like... below. Leave a note below. <laughs> what do you think? In the notes section below. What do you think of Calhoun's coffee? That's a good coffee? one. Thanks. All right, well, in that case, I believe that is the time to close this episode out. Watch VHS. Yeah. Woo, 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 woo. Woo, 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 woo. See you guys next week. Mm. Calhoun's coffee is known for its nose. Thank you.
Always takes me back. Some good coffee. Thank you.